Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be talking about uh, the fight night on ABC. I believe it's number three. Before we get down to this prediction video, of course, it is my opinion. Leave your comments down below. Let me know who you guys are picking in these 12 fights that we have going on. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, hit the thumbs up button as hard as you possibly can. And as always, let's jump right into it. Today, we're talking about Jessica Panay versus Emily Dukota, Dukode, Dukode, something like that. <laughs> Jessica Panay, veteran of the sport. Uh, Emily Dukoto, pretty new in the UFC. This is her first time in the UFC. She won three in, three in a row. She's four in one in the last five fights, 11 and six overall. She's the minus 135 favorite. 28 years old, uh, 5'2", with a 64-inch reach. She's fighting again the uh, longtime vet Jessica Panay. 14 wins, five losses, two and three in her last five, but on a two fight winning streak. 39 years old. She's a plus. She's a, basically a pick 'em. 5'5 um, five, five with a 67 inch reach, so a three inch height and reach advantage. Um, there's a lot of good things that Panay does. Again, she has a lot of momentum, and she can use, um, this girl has 17 fights, Panay, this is her 20th, this is Emily's 18th fight. I, I really, really like Jessica Panay in this fight, I just think she, her style, and her overall ability to uh, sometimes, sometimes adapt in some fights, sometimes she's been like the days ago, and she's been caught early, um, you know, and, and she was finished by Domani and Jacek a long time ago. Finished by Andrade a long time ago. Her last loss on was five years ago. Even though there's a little weird thing in there that's strange. Um, I like Jessica Panay. Again, I think her output, her volume, and her being 11 years older and having a couple more fights and just being around everything that she's been around. Um... I think it helps her in this fight, but Gordiha, Gordina, Gordina, Emily, whatever her name is, Emily Dokoto, Dakota, Dakota. I, I just think she overwhelms her. She, is, Emily, is very, very tough. She's fun to watch. Um, she has big um, power. She got a stoppage three weeks ago. Another stoppage right cross to a head kick, and then a decision. Her last loss was to Kanako um, Morado. By split two years ago, and then she ground and pound uh, Jasia, Jasia Moradin, Moradin, something like that. A lot of finishes. The first round might be a little tough, but I think Panay, being the veteran that she is, will be able to withstand that and draw her Emily into deep water and get that unanimous decision win. It might be a split decision because how close that close it's going to be, but I have Panay winning. And as always, guys, you already know what it is. 